we're gonna be using my giant 16 foot fish trap. Oh, there's something big under there. This is actually a very rare fish. Look at it. Whoa, where does that lead to? It drops off into a sewer. There's fish in here. Oh. What was that? I got a freaking baby blue crawfish. What the heck is that? That's a puffer fish. Oh, what the heck? You see those teeth? That is insane, you guys. That fish is literally see-through. You're so pretty. Wait, there's a big fish in here. I have no idea what this is. What is up, BFP Nation? Welcome back to another awesome video, guys. Today, we're exploring this hidden tunnel that is filled with mysterious fish. This is the same hidden tunnel from about a month ago where we caught that deadly stonefish. And along with the stonefish, we caught a lot of other crazy stuff in here. So we're back today, and we're gonna go back in there to see what else we can catch. Now, the tunnel is really sketchy to go into because you never know what is in there. There could be anything, including gators, snakes, and even deadly spiders. But it's all worth it when we catch these crazy fish. And this tunnel is loaded with them, guys. Now, if you guys remember the first video here, we had three fish traps with us we placed one on this end one in the middle and then one on the other end so we're gonna do the same thing we did the first video we're gonna walk through it and net around to see what we can find but this time guys instead of having three fish traps we're gonna be using one monster one with us today guys we're gonna be using my giant 16 foot fish trap this thing is a freaking monster guys look how long it is and i think this will be the most efficient way to catch fish out of this tunnel we've only used this trap a handful of times and every time we do we catch a lot of fish so what we're gonna do guys we're gonna walk to the middle of this tunnel place it there and leave it there overnight. That's when all the crazy stuff comes out. And if we're gonna catch something crazy, it's gonna be in this monster fish trap. So I'm really excited. But before we do that, guys, we're gonna net around the outskirts of this tunnel. Cause if you remember the first video, we discovered there was prawns here. They're like a mixture between a shrimp and a crawfish and they're huge. We caught a bunch of them. However, we also spotted a giant one. It was about this big and it was right in these rocks, but we actually lost it. So hopefully we can get our revenge day and catch the monster prawn. And then we're gonna head into the tunnel, net around, see what we can catch. And then we're gonna place our fish traps guys so let's start netting around see what we can catch all right we got our net guys oh my gosh i'm looking into this tunnel right now and i am not looking forward to going through that again it gets scarier and scarier every time you don't know what is in there there could literally be a massive gator and you can't see anything because it's dark in there but we got to do what we got to do guys right here in this corner this is where we caught a lot of the prawns so i'm gonna take a net right here and see if we can catch some oh there we go that was a good net nothing in there where are you maybe up in these weeds Ugh. oh yeah look at that look at all these weeds that's where all these fish live Oh, oh yes we got something right away let's dump it out i saw something in there it was moving around <gasps> right here <gasps> yes already look at that first catch of the day it's a freaking goby that's what i was talking about guys there's a lot of gobies in here i still don't know exactly what this is but it's definitely some species of goby we caught hundreds last time and it looks like we're gonna catch a lot this video too second net we already got one now check this out guys today we brought this little container and what we're gonna do we can actually place all of our catches in here to get a better look at them check it out there you go buddy look at that that is so cool that's a little goby if you guys know the exact species let me know in the comments well, that's really cool guys we're gonna get them in a bucket and we're gonna keep netting around and see what else we can catch all right we're gonna get back in this weed pile that's where we cut the goby there's got to be some more stuff living in here oh yeah that was a good net come on what, oh, what is that oh yes check this out i think we got a prawn it was a little one but i think we got one. Oh, it's right here look at that look at that oh that is a prawn check that out you guys third net and we already got ourselves a prawn this guy's not giant but that is what we're after that's so cool they kind of look like a shrimp mixed with a crawfish and they get a lot bit oh my god where'd he go Oh, he's right here. We're gonna get this guy in a bucket. We'll take him home, but we're after his mother, okay? We want one this big. Look, there's a fish in here too. Another goby. Oh my gosh, like I said, these things are freaking everywhere. There you guys go. Got some more keepers in there. We're gonna do a few more nets before we go into the tunnel, guys. I actually wanna stick my net under all these rocks because like I said, that's where the monster prawn was. And we're gonna see if we can catch it. Here we go. All right, we're gonna go under this rock. Oh, this is scary. Oh, there's something big under there. Oh, I got it. What the heck is that? That is not a prawn. That's a fish. What the? Is that a snake head? It looks like a baby snake head. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, guys. Hold on a second. No freaking way. Is that what I think it is? You guys. Oh my gosh. We freaking did it. That is not a goby and that is not a snake head. It kind of looks like one, but that right there is something special. That's something very rare. And I've literally been trying to catch one of these fish for like two or three years right now. And I've never even seen one. Oh my gosh. I'm shaking. Oh no. You guys, that right there, I think is a big mouse sleeper. Oh my 
my gosh, that's actually insane. It's a type of goby actually, but they get huge. They get like this big. That is actually insane. I thought it was a snakehead, but no, this is actually a very rare fish. You guys, the reason there's so many crazy fish at the spot is because it's actually brackish water. If you don't know what that means, it's basically a mix between salt water and fresh water. And that means there's a lot of crazy creatures that you don't normally see. Check that out. Oh my gosh, look how cool that fish is, you guys. Holy crap, look how cool that is. It looks like a little snakehead. I cannot believe it right now, guys. We're definitely taking this guy back. I have wanted to keep one as a pet for so long and we finally can do it, guys. So we're gonna add this guy to a little tank later in today's video and we got ourselves a pet big mouth sleeper. Oh my gosh, okay. I think it's time, guys. We're gonna head into the tunnel now, net around, see what we can catch doing that and then we're gonna place our fish traps. Look at this, guys. The water looks like it's a lot higher this time, which is... um it's good and not good probably means there's more fish but it's gonna be a little bit more sketchy because we're probably gonna be like knee deep and there could literally be anything so it's a little scary there's also these weird pink eggs everywhere i mean look at this these are eggs and they're everywhere they're all over the tunnel i think they're snail eggs comment down below if you know but yeah guys we're gonna grab our net and we're gonna venture off into the tunnel and see what else we can find Kind of looked like a snakehead. I had it, right? It was in my net. Okay, well, that's scary. That that was like a fish this big, guys. Like I said, the water's a lot higher right now. That could mean bigger fish. That, that could mean alligators. Oh, that was really scary. I didn't even see him. Okay. Um, a little scared. <laughs> We're in the tunnel right now, guys. This is what we're using to keep all the fish that we catch. It's a little live well that I'm gonna drag behind me. Here we go, guys. Yeah, the water's a lot deeper than last time. And this is all we have. This is one flashlight. Hopefully, if there's a gator in here, we will see it. Oh my gosh, Helen, Helen, first fish. I see a fish. What is that? Get in the net, buddy. No! Oh, come on towards you. Oh, Helen, look, there he is. He's coming back for more. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. He's so aggressive. <laughs> I think it was a tilapia, so not, not a gator. That was so scary. I don't know where he went. Oh, this is going to be crazy. Oh, look, there's a little tunnel right here. Where does that, oh, whoa, where does that lead to? I remember in the first video, I didn't want to crawl through that one. I don't know, should I go through this one this time? Well, I guess I gotta do it. Okay guys, first tunnel I'm gonna be exploring today. It's it's a tunnel inside of a tunnel. Don't know where it leads to, but I see water down there. It's a tight squeeze. Mm, yeah, you call me fat? Um, You're saying I'm as round as this. <laughs> Wait, look at this, there's snails everywhere. So whatever this leads to, there's water and there's stuff living in it because there's snails everywhere. How am I gonna turn around? I'm almost there. What the heck? Helen, can you hear me? Yeah. It drops off into a sewer. There's fish in here. Oh, I got it. Oh, I got it! I got a fish! I'm coming back! You look so silly. Uh, oh, I'm so tired. I got a fish. I can't see what it is. Oh my god. There were so many spiders in there. This is the scariest thing ever. What did we get? Oh, oh my god, Helen. What the? Oh, it's orange! Wait a minute! I didn't even see what it was. I just saw a fish swimming. It looks like... Oh, dude, look how cool that is. Oh my gosh! Look at the colors on that fish. It looks like some sort of pike cichlid, but I've never seen one that colorful. Oh my god. All right, let me get out of here. I got another thing in my pocket. Look at this, you thought that was cool. Check this out. Look at this. Look at that. <laughs> oh, oh no. no! Where'd it go? Oh wait, he's right here. It's a little half tadpole, half frog. A little Demogorgon thing. That tunnel goes on a long way. Took some nets. There was a lot of fish in there, but I'm definitely not going back. That was way too much work. Oh my gosh, look at the colors on that fish. That is so cool. Okay, first fish in the tunnel. That right there is definitely a keeper. We're gonna get him in the little live well. There he goes. Zip it up. He can't get out. Let's keep going, see what else we can find. Oh my gosh, Helen, look at this. There is spider webs everywhere. Look above us. Holy crap, I just looked at the ceiling. Look, there's one there, one there, one there. They're everywhere. Oh, that's not good. They look like, like, bad spiders. <laughs> oh, and another big fish. Oh, my God. He's oh, no, oh, no. <laughs> not again. Oh, right. There's a prawn. There's a prawn on the bottom. Oh, I think I got him. Yes, I got him. Look at that guy. He's got another prawn right here. That one's a little bit bigger. We're going to throw that guy in the live well. Another prawn. Not the monster we're after, though. We want one, like, ten times that size. You have a spider web stuck to your hat. Are you serious? Is there a spider, too? I don't think so. Okay. Oh, I feel it. Oh my god. It's okay. up, it's up, it's up. Watch oh. Oh, oh, now it's on again. I feel it. Ah! Oh wait, look behind us, behind us. There's a fish. Look right here, he's swimming against the current. See him? Come on, buddy, get in the net. Look at him, he's swimming off the current. Oh no! Get back here, get in the net. 
I got him! What the heck is that? Oh, wait a minute. I've caught this before. I've never caught one this big though. That is insane, guys. Another insane fish. We're gonna add him to the live well. Pretty sure it's called a leaf fish. Haven't caught one of those here before. So that just shows there's a lot of fish here, a lot of species. And yeah, this is crazy, guys. Let's add him to the live well. There you go, buddy. Go on. This thing is so handy. I love having this thing, especially in tunnels. Oh my god, look right here. Look right here. There's a bigger fish. Please get in the net. Oh, 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 he's right there. He's right. What is that? What the heck is that? Ah, I didn't get him. I don't even know what that was. Oh! What was that? What was Bobby, that? what was that? That was huge. Uh, I don't want to walk anymore. That was scary, guys. We just heard like a giant thrash down there. It sounded close, too. Like, that was close. What do we do? I don't, I don't know. Uh, honestly, guys, that could be a freaking gator. It sounded like one. I have a gun. <laughs> this is scary, guys. I'm telling you, going in these tunnels is no joke. We got to do it, though. We got to keep going. We have to. Oh, we've made it to the second tunnel. That's the one we caught the massive red crawfish, so we know that has fish in it. Oh, it's so scary. At least this one isn't as long. All right, here I go. Wish me luck. This hole is smaller than the other one, I think. Yeah, well, apparently I'm fat, so. <laughs> oh, there's so many sp Oh my God, there's so many spiders. Holy crap, Helen, there's crawfish. Colorful crawfish. There's a freaking orange one. Oh my God, okay. I got one. Yes, I got one. Look at that. I got a freaking baby blue crawfish. Holy crap, that is insane. There's more in there too, there's a bunch. I don't think I've ever caught a blue crawfish this small. Look how tiny he is. It's a little baby, that is so insane. Okay, we're gonna get this guy in the live well and then I'm gonna go back in there. Cause there was a lot more, we gotta catch them all. It's just a little baby. There he goes. I gotta go back in, there's more in there. Oh, this tunnel's a lot freaking tighter. Oh, there's a spider. Oh, that is a scary looking spider. Please do not bite me. Here we go. Let's see if we can get these crawfish. Look at this. The water's so clear. Where did they go? I swear. <gasps> there's one. There's one right there. I see it. I see it on the camera. That looks like a baby orange one. Okay. Oh, he's so tiny. Come on. Get in the net. I got him. I think I got him, Helen. Look at this. Where'd he go? There he is. Look at that. That's a baby orange one about the same size as that blue one. That is so crazy. Oh, my God. Oh, my. There's a fish. There's a fish? There's a fish. Really? Helen says she sees a fish. Where is it? You still see it? Yeah, it's right here to my right. Okay. Ugh. Oh no. no! Oh no! Eagle, Mr. Crawfish! Alright, where is it? Oh, it's right there! It's right there! You see him? Right in the sand. Come on, buddy. Come on, get in the net. I got him. I think I got him. Yes! We got it! What is it? It looks like another pike. Oh wait, no, that's not a pike. What the heck is that? Kinda looks like a gar. Oh my gosh, wait, look at that thing! Look at his mouth! Oh my gosh, that is freaking insane! Good eye, Helen. Alright, let's have him to the live well. There he goes. Oh god, we got so much more to go. I mean, look at that. You just don't see it. That is so scary. I think there's another little blue crab. Where? Where? <gasps> oh my god, there is one! Look at him, he's crawling up the bank right now. Oh no! No, no, no. Get in there. Come on, buddy. Come on. Yes, we got him! Helen, you spotted another one! Look at that! That one wasn't even in the tunnel. Maybe he crawled out. Look how tiny he is. That's smaller than the other ones. Dude, that is so cute. It's literally uh -huh. the size of my fingernail. It was right here, right on the wall. There could be more. That is so crazy, guys. At night, everything comes to life. All the crawfish, all the prawns that are usually under rocks, they start exploring, they start looking for food, and that's what this guy was doing. Let's get him in the live well. There you go, buddy. Okay, let's keep walking down and keep exploring this tunnel. Oh, gee, there's a roach! It's a massive roach! Look at that thing! Jesus Christ, that is the biggest roach I've ever seen. We're not scared of like gators and snakes, but roaches, no thank you. Alright guys, so the game plan is once we fully get through this tunnel, we're gonna then come back and place our giant fish trap in the middle. It was just too big to bring. So we're gonna explore this, see what all we can catch. Then we're gonna come back, set our fish trap, and leave it overnight. But for now, we're gonna keep exploring and see what else we can find. Oh, what is that? What is that? Oh, uh, it's a lot scarier this time. Look at the water. It's so freaking murky. We can't, oh my God, we can't even see in it. Oh my God, there's a spider. Oh, Jesus. That is a big freaking spider. Look at the prawn going. <laughs> Look at his giant arms. That's actually a pretty big one. Where'd it go? Oh, there's a fish right there too. Oh, it's a big fish. Get in the net. Get in the net. Yes. I love how there's a current here. It makes it so much easier. You just stick their net right in front of them and they just flow right into it. I don't know what that means. <gasps> Whoa! That's actually so pretty. I think it's a Texas cichlid. Look how gorgeous that fish is, you guys. Oh my gosh. We were going after the prawns. I don't know where they went, but we got something way better. I think we caught one of these last time here, too. Look at that. Look at the fins. Oh, he's got a boo-boo. Yeah, it looks like something tried to bite him right here. You see that? That is a really cool fish. The biggest one so far. We're going to get him in a little live well. That is so freaking cool, guys. A Texas cichlid. I wonder how far we are from the other side of the tunnel, guys. I think we're a little close because I can hear the cars from the other side. I don't know, guys. We're just going to keep going. 
Oh, the end is right there. But guys, we've almost made it. I see the other side of the tunnel. Finally, guys, we've been in here for literally like 30 minutes. As soon as we get to the other side there, we're gonna see if we can catch any fish. And then we're gonna set all three fish traps, guys. One there, one on the other side, and then one in the middle, the giant 16 footer. Ew, look at his slime trail. Wait, where did he come from? Oh, he's making his way down the <laughs> Here, we'll help him out. There you go, buddy. <laughs> oh. Oh, there he goes. Well, guys, we've made it to the other side of the tunnel. Oh, there's a lot of fish on this side. I see a lot of fish. So now that we've made it to the other side, it's time to start placing our fish traps. We have three in total. This one, though, we're going to place at this spot. We discovered this last video. It had some really crazy fish in it. It's like some sewer or something. I don't even know what it is, but there's a lot of fish. So let's place our first fish trap. What is that? What is that? <gasps> Holy crap, Helen. That's a puffer fish. That's a giant puffer fish. Oh my God, there's a snakehead right next to him. Oh my God. There's a snakehead right there. I want this puffer fish though. This thing almost got eaten by that snakehead. What was that? You guys, there's fish everywhere. Oh my God, I got him. Look at that. It's a massive puffer fish. That is the biggest one I've ever seen. Holy crap. That is the coolest thing we've caught so far. That right there is some sort of freshwater puffer fish. I'm not sure the exact name. Look how gentle he is. He's just cruising around. <laughs> he was sitting right next to that snakehead. That is so crazy. Okay. Well, I wasn't expecting to catch any fish right now. So we got to go get our live well and get this guy in it. And then we're going to place our fish trap. Oh my gosh. That is so cool. This guy was so slow that I was actually able to grab him with my hand. They're not the best swimmers. By far the biggest one I've ever caught. We're going to go ahead and get him into the live well. There he goes. Oh, that is so cool. Well, guys, this seems like the perfect spot to place our first fish trap so here we go now last time there was a breeding pair of giant snakeheads you know what that little baby that was next to the puffer fish that could have been the baby but we got to be careful hopefully we don't run into them right now oh there's some fish right there i don't even know what those are check that out i see three fish oh i see a bunch of little gobies on the bottom oh my god there's a lot wait there's one in the corner here Ugh. oh my god what is that check this out that is not a oh it's a baby snook you guys, check that out. That is a baby snook. We were doing a little net in here before we placed the fish trap just to see what we can catch. And this right here is actually a baby snook, the first one of the night. Like I said, guys, this is brackish water, and this is actually a saltwater fish. So that is really cool. We just caught him here. We're going to let him go, though. This is illegal to keep. So there he goes. See ya, buddy. This is such a crazy spot, guys. And then you look over here on the other side, and there's a tunnel right here. We don't know where... <gasps> Oh my god, what the heck are all those fish? Look Helen, do you see those? Snake snakeheads. Really? Wait, look at them. There's so many of them. Those are baby snakeheads. Okay. Like I was saying, guys, we saw a breeding pair here, and those have to be the babies. This is where they were. I think I'm going to try and catch some of them. I'm just going to take a scoop right here. Oh, oh, they were all right there. Oh, there's the big one. The big ones are in that corner. Oh my god. Holy crap, I think we got some of them. Oh, <gasps> what the heck? Wait. Oh my god. Helen. Helen, no way. That's not a freaking snakehead. No. <gasps> That's another big mouth sleeper. It's so much bigger. Look at that, you guys. That is that fish we caught in the beginning of the video. Just a little baby. Holy crap, that is a lot bigger than that one, though. That is so crazy. Look at the mouth on him. Look at the teeth. You see those teeth? That is insane, you guys. I didn't even see him. I was going for the baby snakeheads. We didn't get any snakeheads, but we did get this guy. A giant big mouth sleeper. We're going to add him to the live well. They're everywhere here. That is two in one night. Maybe we'll get one twice this size. Who knows? Check that out, guys. Monster big mouth sleeper going into the live well we're gonna place the first fish trap right in that corner there that looks good okay now we're gonna head back to the other side of the tunnel you guys right where we start we're gonna place a fish trap there and then we're gonna place a 16 foot fish trap i am so excited to see what we catch in that it's been an insane night so far we've caught a lot of fish we're gonna keep going guys here we go all right you guys we've made it to the other side of the tunnel and we have the second fish trap and right now we're gonna go ahead and place it right next to the flow oh there's actually a lot of fish down there oh my god i should get my neck guys i see a lot of fish all right here we go we're gonna take a big net right here. That's where that snakehead was. But I see a lot of smaller fish down here too. Come on, there's gotta be something. Ugh. Oh, there was one right there. What the heck is that? I think we got it. <gasps> oh, it's right there. We did get it. What is that? Oh my God. Wait, what? I could see through it. Wait, I literally see through it right now. Is that normal? Ew. Oh my God. <gasps> That fish is literally see-through. Oh my gosh. Look at that. You can literally see my hand right through that fish. <gasps> There's another one. There's two of them. No freaking way. What the heck are those things? You guys, this, ew, that is the most like disgusting fish I've ever seen. You can see everything. Let's get them in the little container. These things are insane looking. I've never seen anything like that. Oh my gosh. Can you see them? They're rainbow. Oh my God. There's a rainbow. Do you see that rainbow? You see the rainbow on it, oh right? Oh my God. 
Oh Wait, what? You see it too? They're so pretty. You guys, I'm baffled right now. I, I don't even know what is happening. Whenever we put a light up to these fish, they start glowing like rainbow. It's actually insane. I have never seen anything like it. If you know what's going on here, I, I have no idea. I don't know what these fish are. I don't know why they're rainbow, but we're keeping them, okay? We're gonna get them in the bucket full of keepers. There they go. That is literally so insane. But that's gonna be a perfect spot to place our fish trap. Maybe we'll catch more of those. Maybe we'll catch something else. We don't know. So let's get the second fish trap placed. We got these fish traps made up with tilapia. Everything loves tilapia. Here we go, guys. Second trap going in right there. Oh, that is not gonna stay. Uh, what if we place it right down in here? I think that should work. Yeah, there we go. The fish trap's staying there. That looks really good, guys. Now it is time. The moment you've all been waiting for, we're going to place this 16 foot fish trap and then we're going to leave all three overnight. So we're going to have to venture off back into the tunnel and place our monster fish trap. Here we go. Oh my God. You guys, check this out. Look at this giant snakehead. It's a massive snakehead. What's up, buddy? Oh, oh, hello. What's up? Oh my gosh. Well, guys, we're in the middle of the tunnel yet again. We just came across a massive snakehead. So this is a good spot to place our giant 16 foot fish trap. Oh my gosh, look at this. It's freaking huge. We're placing the monster fish trap. This thing is huge. It literally covers like the whole tunnel. Let's leave it right here. There we go. That is perfect, you guys. Check that out. Who knows what we're going to catch, guys. So what we're going to do, guys, we're going to come back in maybe three or four hours, right in the middle of the night. And we're going to check all the fish traps. Hopefully we catch something crazy. And yeah, guys, we'll see you then. All right, you guys, it has been three and a half hours and we're back at the hidden tunnel. We're going to start things off here, right at the beginning of the hidden tunnel. All right, we're going to get some water in this bucket right here. Oh no, where's the trap? Where's the trap? Oh, it's right there. Okay, thank God. Oh yes, come on. We're going to lift it up right here. Oh, wait a minute. Ooh, yes, we got a fish. We got multiple fish. Let's see what they are. Oh, ew. Wait, there's a big fish in here. What the heck? Check this out. First fish. Whoa. I think that's a, wait, I think that's a leaf fish. Wait, but we caught one before and it looked nothing like it. Is that a leaf fish? I can't tell. That's really crazy though. The heck? Okay, we'll get him in the bucket. There's a lot of fish in here, you guys. <gasps> More of those see-through fish. Look at this. Oh, that's a big one. There's some sort of catfish in here. Look at that. Is that a synodontus? It doesn't even look like one. It's like different colored. How many more we got? Oh, we got a big fish right here. What is this? Oh my, Texas cichlid? What the heck is that? Hold on, you guys. Wait, I think it's actually called a Salvini cichlid. We don't catch these too often. And that is a massive one. That is so cool. Look at that. We got another one. That is two in the fish trap. There he goes. I think that might be it. Oh, no, there's someone else. What are... <gasps> Whoa, wait, what? Oh my God, that's a baby Oscar right there. Look at that, a little itty bitty Oscar. And then one of these little gobies here. These guys are common, but we'll still keep them. He's cool. Another x-ray fish, check this out. These guys are everywhere in here. You probably don't see these guys too often because they're literally see-through. But I was shining my light into the water and I saw that little flicker. All right, let's empty it out, see if we miss anything. I think that is it, you guys. Wow, what an insane first fish trap, guys. Check out all the fish that we caught. Look at that, we got a full bucket just from one trap. We got this crazy fish. I I think this is called a leaf fish. That's really cool. We got a massive Salvini cichlid. I think this is a Cynodontis of some sort. We got a Gobi, a little Oscar, and a bunch of these guys, these little see-through x-ray fish. We're gonna head to the other side, check the other fish trap, and then we're gonna check the monster one last. Let's head to the other side and see what's in the other fish trap. All right, you guys, we've made it to the next fish trap and we have a brand new bucket here. We're gonna fill it up with water. And we're gonna see what we call it. Here we go. Get some nice water right here. Look, there's a fish right here. Ready? I'm gonna grab it with my hand. Oh, dang it. As you can see, there's fish everywhere. There's monster snakeheads. So let's see what we caught. Here we go. Come on, give me some. Whoa, what the heck is that? Whoa, big fish, baby. There's a lot of fish in here, actually. Is that a baby snakehead? I think we got a baby snakehead. Check this out. Let's see what we caught. Oh, that's a prawn. <laughs> oh, yeah, we got another little prawn. We'll add him to the bucket. Oh, my God. Helen, the Mayan cichlid. Your favorite. We're not going to add him to the bucket. A snail. Wow. Caught a lot of crazy stuff in this trap, guys. <laughs> oh, my God. Another snail. Come on. <laughs> no freaking way. More Oscars. Oh, this one's gorgeous. Oh, my. No. No, 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 no. I got him. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That was close. Look at that. Another gorgeous Oscar. We'll add him to the bucket. I think there was another. Yeah, there's two in here. Check this out. It looks just like the other one. They have to be siblings. That is so freaking cool. There's a little baby snakehead. Oh, <gasps> oh my God. That's not a snakehead. That's a no, no freaking way. That is another big mouth sleeper. Another little itty bitty baby. That is three in total tonight. After never seeing one in my life. That is actually insane, you guys. This spot is loaded with them. And we got a really big fish. I can't tell what it is right now. There we go. What is that? Oh my, dude, that is a giant leaf fish. That's like the one we caught in the tunnel, but that one's like double its size. I've never seen one that big. I don't even know they got that big. Beautiful fish. 
add him to the bucket. That might be it. Let's do a double check. Oh, we got another one. Oh, this is a goby. See, this one right here is the big mouth sleeper. I don't know which one this one is, but you can see they are different. That is crazy, guys. We're going to keep them both. Man, guys, those big mouth sleepers are literally insane. I cannot believe we've caught three tonight. Well, that's it for the second fish trap, guys. Now, the moment you've all been waiting for, we're going to check the 16-footer inside of the hidden tunnel, and we're going to see what we caught in that. That's the one I'm most excited for. So let's head over there and see what we caught. Now, since it's such a far walk, I'm just going to go there by myself, grab the trap, and then come out with it. And then we're going to go through it together out here. It'll be way too hard to go through everything inside of the tunnel. So here we go, guys. Hi. Bye. Safe travels. Thank you. I'm here. I got the trap. There's some giant fish in here. I got a big snakehead. There's other fish too. Oh my God, that was so scary. I could have sworn I saw an alligator like three different times. We got our 16 foot fish trap and there were so many fish in there. I didn't look too much, okay? I didn't want to spoil it without you guys, but there's a giant snakehead right here, right at the front. Oh my gosh. All right, we're going to untie this right here so we can just let this snakehead go. See ya, buddy. Gotcha. Look at that. We got ourselves a snakehead in the fish trap. That's crazy. We saw a lot in that tunnel, so it makes sense. There he goes. All right, let's pull it all the way through and see what else we caught. Let's see, where are the fish? My God, this trap is so big. Oh, there's a fish right here. The trap is so big, it's so hard to get the fish out. Oh, oh my, oh my gosh. There's a massive gar in there and a playco. All right, buddy, get out of here. Look at that, guys. We got ourselves a gar. That is crazy. Oh my gosh. Guys, comment down below. Should we keep a gar for the prairie pond? We're not going to keep this guy, but if you want to see it, we'll go out and we'll try to catch a big gar for our pond. But this guy, we're just going to let go. See ya, buddy. Nothing crazy yet, but I do see some other fish in there. Got the little playco here. We're not going to keep this guy either. We're just going to let him back go. There he goes. Oh yeah, here we go. Here we go. What is that? Oh my gosh. Look at the size. Oh, this Texas cichlid. Oh my gosh, look how chunky that is. Beautiful coloration, such a cool fish. We're definitely keeping this one, guys. There he goes into the keeper bucket. What else do we have? I saw some other fish. Here we go. What is this guy? Whoa, what the heck is that? Whoa, no, no, I got him. Oh my God. Look at that, he's got beautiful orange fins though. I don't know what that is. It's got some cool coloration. We're gonna keep him. There he goes. Oh my God. What the, holy crap, Helen. You see that? I have no idea what this is. Look at this. Ew, it feels so weird. Look at that. It's the size of my hand. Oh my gosh, these spines are so sharp, guys. Look at this fish we just caught. I'm not sure the name of this one. Actually, you know what? We made a video at the Walmart sewers not too long ago. I think we caught babies because I remember they felt really weird. This guy feels so weird. Helen, touch it. It's like leather. Tico, tico. <laughs> is he alive? He's not even moving. Oh, he is. <laughs> He's moving. Let's see what else we caught in this fish trap. Come on. Anything else? Come on. There's no way that's it. I think that actually is it, guys. But we did catch a good amount of fish, guys. I think that is all for that trap. This guy's insane looking. I really like him. And then another Texas cichlid. Look how fat this one is. And then the third one is a mystery fish. I don't know what this is, but he's got really pretty fins. Well, guys, that is all three fish traps right now out of the hidden tunnel. We caught so many fish in total, guys, with the nets, with the fish traps. So what we're going to do, we're going to head back to my house and get all the keepers into the ponds and tanks. If you guys want me to come back and make a part three at this hidden tunnel that is filled with mysterious fish all you gotta do is let me know in the comments but for now we're gonna head back to my house and get these fish into their new homes here we go all right you guys we've made it back to my house and we're starting things off here at the mystery pond check it out guys the mystery oh look look there's one of the eels oh look there's one of the guard too everyone in here is doing really good guys and a lot of the stuff that we caught today we're gonna add into this pond so here we go we're gonna start by adding both of the texas cichlids there they go we're definitely gonna add this guy in here too because we have no idea what it is and it's really cool looking so there he goes we have a giant salvini cichlid there he goes oh look Hello, buddy. And then we got this guy, a little Cynodontus. There he goes. We got some other really cool fish here. We got this guy. I think this is a leaf fish. We're going to add him in. Oh, look. Hello. Then we got this guy, the really cool fish with the orange fins. There he goes. And right here, guys, we got three baby Oscars. We're going to add them to the pond. Once they get big enough, we're going to add them to the Oscar army. And now, guys, we have just a few more fish we're going to add here, including the big mouth sleepers. We got the two baby big mouth sleepers. We're going to add them there. But for the big guy, we got a special spot for him. We're going to be adding the big guy to the Oscar pond. Check it out. No. Oh. Well, he's in there. <laughs> wasn't too graceful, but the big mouth sleeper is in the Oscar pond. Now guys, we're at the crawfish jungle gym. We caught a lot of crawfish today. Just a bunch of little babies, but they're blue, they're orange, and we're gonna get them into the crawfish jungle gym. There's a giant blue one right there. There's a giant orange one. And look how many guppies there are everywhere, all around the pond. That's why this is the perfect habitat for all the crawfish. They just got endless food whenever they want. They get huge in here. So these guys are gonna get big real quick in here. So there they go. And now guys, we're here 
at the mini pond. Now we're gonna be adding the rest of the fish that we caught today into this pond. Right here, we got the little puffer fish, we got the leaf fish, and we have all these little see-through fish. And this is the perfect habitat for all of them. So let's get them in. Now we have a couple of these guys in here already. I think they're leaf fish. And right here, guys, is literally the biggest puffer fish I have ever seen. We have some in here already, but nowhere near this guy's size. Oh, look at him, look at his little fins. That is so cool. And right here, guys, we have all these crazy mystery fish that are literally see-through. Please comment down below what those are because I have no idea. All I know is they're really cool and they got that crazy rainbow color. But yeah, guys, that was crazy. We caught so many insane fish out of the hidden tunnel once again. If you want us to go back and do a part three, all you gotta do is go down there and let me know. So hit the like button if you did enjoy. Subscribe down below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.